That is how you win power in this country. And I am a sensible, moderate, one nation conservative. That's where I want my party to go. And I'm going to work my hardest to make sure that happens. Alicia Kearns, we have to end there. But thank you for joining me on Hard Talk. Hello there. This time last week, low pressure dominated the weather story and it was all about relentless flooding rain. This week, high pressure controls the story and a quiet, colder theme, but also a sunnier one. In fact, the Western Isles had the lion's share of the sunshine on Tuesday. Still plenty of sunshine around today as high pressure dominates. Clear skies across central and southern England. That's where we'll have the best of the sunshine, but it will be another cold start with temperatures below freezing. Not as widespread the cold as we had this time yesterday, and there's certainly more cloud. Now, the cloud is thick enough across eastern Scotland and northern England for the odd spot of light drizzle. Could be some icy stretches first thing. South of that, we'll see more cloud pushing into North Wales, but we'll keep some sunshine. And we'll also have some sunshine once again in the far northwest of Scotland. Now, temperatures around five to seven degrees. Might be a degree or so warmer underneath the cloud, but it perhaps won't feel like that because you've lost the sunshine. Now, we keep that cloud as we go through Wednesday night. And once again, could be thick enough for a little bit of drizzle, particularly on exposed North Sea coast. Best of the clearer skies are further south of that. That's where we're likely to see patchy frost and fog forming as temperatures again dip below freezing. So as we move into Thursday, it will be a similar story. We'll have some clearer skies into sheltered western Scotland and also some sunshine across central and southern England. But cloud will tend to come and go into northern Ireland, northern England for a time. And some of that cloud may well just push that little bit further south as the wind changes to more of a subtle northeasterly by the course of Thursday. Once again, temperatures between 5 and 8 degrees are overall high. Now, as we move into Friday and the start of the weekend, we keep this quieter theme. It's still going to be on the chilly side, but again, there'll be a lot of dry weather around. But as we go into next week, there are signs of the weather story changing. The wind direction coming to more of a northerly. We could see some wintry showers even at lower levels in Scotland. And look at this, towards the middle part of next week, there will be a frontal system as it bumps into that cold air that's been sitting with us now for over a week there is the potential on the leading edge to see some snow. A lot of uncertainty about that at the moment, but it's an early heads up, something to look out for.